Okay, we're back. This uh, is me on microflight, and we are testing the MPG ultralight radio control auto gyro with LED lights fitted to the rotor head and tail fins. The LEDs have been fitted to the production blades. These are the white blades here. The blades uh, have a small battery to power the LEDs. The LEDs do not come as part of the kit. This is uh, an accessory that will be extra. Uh, it does add for an interesting effect while flying in uh, at night or under subdued lighting, such as uh, this area that we're flying. It's called the sack, which is uh, lit up by one street lamp. Dad, I'm running out of battery, so let's just try to fly it as long as you can. Okay, in this particular segment of this video, I went back to the original stock blades yeah. so that it, we can uh, put the other blades with the LEDs with the battery on recharge. I'm flying it around at uh, low levels. The particular design nature of the MPG is what allows this type of flying in an area such as this cul-de-sac. And this is these particular lighting Dude, I'm, conditions. I'm catching all of this. This is cool. I would not attempt He's gonna though. <laughs> to do this type of flying with a larger and heavier RC auto gyro as there are risks involved not only to the model but also objects and people the light. Dang, this is flying good, Dad <laughs> The MPG is very lightweight slightly under 5 ounces It's a very docile flyer Dad, fly it in the light, like where Wesley and I are standing. Uh, Wesley, get on the sidewalk. I'm going to be doing some figure eights very shortly here. Also again at low level flying. Just so that we can capture the uh, model on, on video. Okay, if I fly it too high, the model gets lost and we the won't be able to appreciate the, uh, the flight. <laughs> And the end. You can also see the blades as it's uh, going away from the camera. You can see the blades uh, Just start, like, zapping it. <laughs> a little bit better. Here I'm doing some sharp turns <laughs> and going into a figure eight. Going to left and right. And the MPG, particular weight and set up is what allows this model to fly with a man in it. very well <laughs> a little while I'm going to be doing a touch and go which is uh, possible as long as the rotor blades are kept in motion <laughs> go here's a touch and go lifts right up I'm going to be approaching a very sharp turn which is uh, accomplished by the use of uh, a little bit of pitch and roll along with uh, power management power management it's basically throttle control and here we go. We're going to be starting a turn, going into a straight flight, coming into a small turn. We're going to be coming straight on again. And we're going to be doing a very sharp turn here. Watch this turn. 
cut down on the throttle let the model do the turn naturally apply a little bit of roll a little bit of elevator use throttle to come to a landing very nice landing and this is the MPG thanks for watching